Hi everybody, I'm Chris Dardis. I'm the Vice President of Human Resources Search and Consulting here at Perseek. I've been in the recruiting industry for about 19 years and I've been a part of a lot of salary negotiations. What I'm gonna share with you today are three tried and true tips to make salary negotiations just a little bit easier. Okay, so tip number one, uh, have realistic expectations. As individuals within this marketplace are moving from one job to another, we're seeing they're able to command anywhere from a 10 to a 15% base salary increase. But to achieve that salary increase, you must prove to the hiring leader the value that you are gonna to bring to the organization. Hiring leaders are going to be considering internal equity. They're also going to be considering their budget that they have to spend. And you have to prove to them that the money that they give you is going to bring value to them. Okay, tip number two, set and understand your own boundaries. Throughout an interview process, hiring leaders could typically ask you, what is your salary range? And rather than saying anywhere from 60,000 to 70,000, because what just happened there is you told them you wanted 70, but they heard 60. So be very specific. If they ask you for a range, be specific with numbers and how you would react to each of the numbers. For example, say, I would take this role for $70,000, no questions asked. And if I was offered 65, I'd probably have to think about it for the weekend. I'm still considering some other roles. It would be a tough decision for me. And also, if the role came in under $60,000, I wouldn't accept it at all. Okay, tip number three for salary negotiations. Give to get. If you're at the end of the salary negotiations process, or you're trying to make a counter offer to the client, it's really important that you give them insight as to how you'll react if they give you additional money. For instance, I would recommend saying something like, Mr. or Mrs. Hiring Manager, if you were to give me an additional $10,000, or if you were able to give me this amount of money, what you will get from me is I will give my two week notice at my current employer, and I'll start with you in three weeks. So if they understand what they're going to receive by giving you a little bit more, it always makes it a little easier. Hey, thanks everybody for joining me. I hope these tips help. Best of luck in your negotiations.